Well, good morning from Arizona. We are about 100 yards into the state. Truly. Um, yeah, and we have, uh, how would you, what would you say about today? Well, we've had to pivot, you know. We kind of thought we were going to go towards Kanab and uh, have our very first dispersed camping experience. But 15 to 20 mile an hour winds. Uh... And lows of 20 at night, which is just too, too cold. So we're going south, because theoretically it's warmer souther. And uh, um, the main objective was to do a shakedown cruise for our trailer. And uh, we'll, we'll show you that in a little bit. Um, this will be the first time we've taken it off road. And uh, we'll see how the truck does, how the suboverland does, how the trailer does, how the bikes do in the trailer, et cetera. That's the main goal. Um, Let's have some fun. And we'll try to have some fun and we'll be exploring we'll be a new area. Walking about and yeah. brought our bikes with us. Yeah. So, so um, it's a different kind of adventure. Hope you'll come along and, and discover with us what there is to see and, and how all the equipment works. are uh, breaking in our trailer, so to speak, taking it off road for the first time and uh, kind of giving it a shake down cruise. A lot of shaking on this road today, <laughs> but uh, so far so good. All right, so we are uh, doing some exploration on the bikes, checking out a road. Uh, it takes us into several campsites, but we wanted to, you know, check out the road before we brought a big rig and a trailer in. And uh, the part that we were, th the campsite that we were thinking about, it's no go. There's a pretty deep uh, trench across the road. There's no way we would make it with a long wheelbase. But uh, there's a couple of promising sites on the way that we'll that we'll be checking out. So, this road, this 2001 N, this was the one uh, that leads up to a turnaround where. We were thinking of camping, but uh, no, nah. today isn't the day. So we kind of uh, retraced one of our favorite YouTubers um, road trip out here and it just kept getting prettier and prettier. It really did. Uh, now we're kind of up in the tree line area, found a sweet little place to uh, camp for the night, did our good deed, leaving it better than we found it. Um, so trash detail marked off. So we're going to go for a little hike and see where this road, where we're uh, dispersed camping off, see where it takes us. Well, I'd say it's been a really, it's been a different and unique day, but it's been a great day. Yeah. Uh, as we mentioned at the beginning of the video, we had to pivot because of weather and bec yeah, because of weather. And so we set out, you know, going south instead of going east. Mm -hmm. And um, and along the way have are well on the way to completing our first true overlanding evening Ooh. overnight. <laughs> and we brought out our little cargo trailer and are testing that out and giving that a shakedown cruise. And it's passed with flying colors. Yeah, yeah. And uh, performed admirably. We got a little e-bike ride in, doing some trail uh, campsite exploration. And uh, it's so quiet out here. It's kind of like backpacking in that you come out and there's no entertainment really, right? You're just you're on your own. It's Until super. the stars come out. Right. It's extremely quiet and uh, and very serene. 
and wonderful. Um, so pleasantly surprised um, at this beautiful place that we found that it's an hour from yeah, home. It's roughly an hour, hour and yeah. a half, just because it's slow going. But anyway, it's been a great day. Uh, we'll probably, uh, we, we'll wake up early as usual, have some coffee and probably head back down the hill and go get some breakfast. Anyway, thanks for coming along today and um, we're looking forward to taking you on more of these uh, yes. boondocking adventures. We're, we're ready, I think. All right. <laughs> See ya.